Hello everyone, it's Laura from Twinkle here. Today I'm going to be talking about some of the fun and creative ways that you can use the Build a Chinese Dragon phonics activity cards, which are available on the Twinkle website. This activity is a fun and colourful way for learners to improve their recognition of phonemes, as well as their ability to sound out and blend words to read. The sheets are differentiated and cover phonemes taught at phonics phases 2, 3, 4 and 5. To complete the activity, encourage learners to fill in the missing spaces on the dragon with a familiar phoneme to make a real word. Ask them to sound out and blend the word they wrote to read, like this, st, op, stop, or sk, ip, skip. The missing spaces that learners have to fill in are sometimes at the beginning of the word, sometimes in the middle and sometimes at the end. You could even laminate the dragons first so that they can be wiped clean and reused. For the set 5 activity, learners can choose to complete a word with no phonemes completed to start with and can instead choose a phoneme from the sheet. Why not ask learners to make a list of as many different words as they can think of in two minutes using one of the dragons? Encourage them to use phonemes from the phonic phase that they are currently working at. In this example, it's phase four. To make this activity even more appealing to learners, you could encourage them to attach the pieces of their dragons to straws or lolly sticks and ask them to join up with others around the room using one of their phonemes with two others to create a real word. You could use these phonemes to test quick recall afterwards by asking learners to call out the phoneme that you are showing, like this. Check learners' understanding by asking them to write a sentence, including two or more of their dragon words. Why not challenge them further by asking them to include an adjective or an adverb in their sentences to describe, like this, the frayed rope suddenly snapped. Finally, you could try playing a guessing game with learners. Tell them you are thinking of a particular word for a dragon. Ask them to guess the phonemes that might be needed to complete that word, like this. Is it p? Yes. Is it o? Oh. No. Is it a? Ah. Yes. Ask them to read the word once they've guessed it. I hope you enjoyed exploring some of the exciting ways that you can inspire learning using the Build a Chinese Dragon phonics activity game, which is available on the Twinkle website. Thanks for watching. See you next time.